What's up, my pilots? Angry Poncho here, and we're back playing Minecraft Hardcore. Minecraft? Minecraft. Anyway, in the last episode, we were searching for this fapper hidden away here in the rock, otherwise known as a slime. But we haven't found him yet, so we're going to continue looking. Trying to figure out where his sound is loudest. That will help us navigate to him. Running into that shaft ahead again. Hey, what is this? I didn't pick up this stuff that I saw right here? Hmm, that's interesting. I really should grab that while we're here. There's a lot of lapis lazuli. That's what someone told that's how someone told me it was pronounced in the comments. Lapis lazuli. I don't know. I think I like lazuli better. Whatevs. Just mispronounce it. Go crazy. Yeah, I guess at this point, with the amount of iron that we've found, I can probably just switch to using iron tools all the time. Just to speed things up. Okay, let's listen. Trying to figure out which direction this guy is, and it's just—it's really, uh, it's really tough. I would—I would, I would su suppose low before high, because they're only going to spawn, I think, in the bottom 32 in this map. So Ooh, there's water. It looks like there's dirt down here. Could be a tunnel entrance nearby. At the very least, it's easier to move through than stones, so let's clear it away, shall we? Hmm. Oh, psh, Jesus. <laughs> I still don't see anything here. Let's get this uh, stone out of the way. Hmm. Where is this guy? These dirt veins are quite frequently next to tunnels. Oh, there's some iron. That's nice. We got a tornado watch in my part of the country right now. Not a warning, just a watch. So I'm betting that, or I'm betting on the fact that I can get this video done before we have a warning, so I don't have to stop right in the middle. Nah, this is a false positive here. This dirt doesn't lead anywhere. Dang it! Nah, crap can't even hear the guy anymore. Did he despawn? I didn't know they did that. Maybe he killed himself. I hear water, though. And a zombie. Hmm. Yeah, I definitely hear a zombie up and to the right. But isn't that out here in this open space that we have? Out here in the cave. Oh, yeah, here he is. Gosh, he was so far away from me to hear him. That slime could have been anywhere. Oh, why is there all this darkness back here still? Have I not explored this part of the cave? What the heck? Oh, wow, I'm officially lost. Alright, um... Why is there this dark part back here? <laughs> he fell in a hole. That's hilarious. You're going to do the same thing, aren't you? Not a very smart creeper. Of course, none of them are very smart, are they? What is this? This is the ravine out here, right. Oof. I just hear enemies all over the place. I don't know where it's safe to be. This is not one of the safe places! <laughs> ah, freaking creepers. Actually took off a piece of my health there, didn't he? The bastard. Oh, there's a tunnel down there. That skeleton has got me nervous. Surprise visits from skeletons can be very bad. Oh, hello, there he is. It's a good thing you guys are really dumb. Oh, he's trying to shoot at me. There we go. What's all that gravel? To oh! My shift key failed me just then. I'm out of torches. Out of coal. 
Oh boy. Um, why is that on? I haven't been using that. I'd like to leave, please. <laughs> Need to get some more coal. There's some right there, actually. Get out of my way. Let's go find some back in a cave where there's actually light. I'll mine it up. We can go explore. Here we go. There's some. I don't need a whole lot. Just enough to get by, man. Ah, uh, of course, coal veins are always huge. Yeah, there was a tunnel going down there, so I suspect that that might lead to where we heard the slime. Because it sounded like it looked like it was going back towards this area and down, so. Still hearing skeletons. It doesn't exactly put me at ease. They're definitely the most dangerous enemies that we're gonna have to deal with in this LP. Death from afar. Being careful here when we dig above ourselves. Not all the coal. Got some more back here. Take this stuff with us too. Why not? That's plenty right there. It's gonna make a lot of torches. How much did I just get? 24. Wow. Yeah. Boom. Alright, do I have any more wood? Nope. Alright, so that's all the torches I have. Once those 45 torches run out, we have to go back up for more wood. Which is kind of lame, but whatevs. Bring all this redstone with me. It could be useful. Who knows? Maybe we'll make some kind of neat contraption with it. Uh, of course, it probably could be used... It probably could be helpful in running together a... Uh, what you call it, a mob grinder of some kind, if I need to have any moving parts or pistons involved. We're going to need to have a bit of redstone going before I can do any of that. Ooh, darkness, yes. Where's my food? I want to eat the bones. Om nom nom. Alright, being cautious. Let's go down this tunnel. Oh yeah, look at the light coming out down there. Looks like we got some lava. Yeah, and there's the water I heard. Yeah, very nice. Alright, let's, uh, stop that. Oi, stop that! And now... There we go. Make this tunnel a bit safer, shall we? Well, we're certainly at the right depth for diamonds right now. Nice and low in the map. Plenty of lava around. Careful, careful. Don't ever overestimate your your water. I like this music. It gives our caving a bit more atmosphere. I'm trying to be a bit more sparse with the torches. There we go. Looks like the dead end there. Alrighty. We'll take the redstone with us. Why not? I've got a quite got quite a bit of it here, very nice. I like to see that. Look at all the little red things. Pick them all up at once. <laughs> That's fun. Alright, well, if, I th if I'm remembering correctly, the amount that's required for me to make... That's safe. That's good. How about that one? Yes, okay, let's get it. The amount of diamonds that I need... I think I need five diamond torches before I can make... Uh, enchanting table. Because I need three to make... Well, I suppose I could make the obsidian with lava and... Hmm. Yeah, with lava and water. But if I wanted to actually mine up the obsidian, obsidian I'm going to need a diamond pickaxe. So... I don't know what the best way to do that is. Hmm. Hello, zombie. I guess we'll just keep exploring until I run out of torches, shall we? Where are you zombies? Let's try and be careful. Don't want to get creeped on. This place is a mess down here. Not exactly easy to navigate. That's some movement over there. Hello, spider. Oh, there's more gravel on the way. Well, they can't seem to get to me over this pile of gravel. Perhaps we can get the height advantage. Here's a skeleton. 
<laughs> the day's mine. Actually, I have a better strategy than this. Can you guys hold this lava for me? <laughs> Thanks, guys. You've been a great help. <laughs> now we shall entomb them forever. Yeah, I think I got him. <laughs> got a dark side tunnel here. Oh, hello. Looks like more lava down at this end. Yep. Very dangerous. Very dangerous caverns. I don't want to try to take that lava from this side, because it's sort of, uh, it's flowing towards me. I I'm downhill of it, and that can end really badly, so. We'll pass on that for now. Taking all the redstone with me, though. That stuff's good. Alright, let's use caution. Where is the skeleton? There he is, he's up top. He shot me on the way down. Wow. Oh, hello. You too, buddy, eh? Where y'all coming from? Is there a spawner up there, or did those two just spawn together? The enemies do tend to appear in groups, so it's not strange to have more than one at a time like that. Alrighty. This, this seems to be some kind of dead end here. Alright, we'll leave it at that. With only 18 torches left. Yeah, come on down, buddy. I'm ready for you. There we go. Critical hit! Let's get out of here, shall we? Oops. Get down from there. I need an axe. Do I have an axe? If I'm still carrying around an axe, that's ridiculous. Oh gosh. Why do I have all this stuff? Alrighty, and we're right back at the treasure chest. See how well planned this was? Ah, now I have all this cobble that I don't need. Get rid of that. Bring this spicy stuff with us instead. Spicy stuff. How about the valuables? Well, hell, take as much as we can with us. All right. I'll leave the workbench and the chest down here, because there's not really a whole lot. They're not exactly uh, super valuable by themselves. Another workbench right here? Yeah, this must be the way out. Not this way, I'm just looking. Yeah, it must be up this direction here. We'll take this workbench with us. Oh, I can't, can I? Alright, get rid of the cobble. That's fine. Don't need that much cobble. Wow, if I can actually make it back out of this cave, I would be very impressed with my navigation abilities. So I'm not... Okay, yeah, now we're gonna go this way. And try to avoid falling mobs. As we get back to our third shaft here, this really short one. If I remember correctly, yes, now we go this way. Wow, another workbench. I've just been putting these things down everywhere. It's kind of handy, though. If I ever need to make anything, it's right down here. Keep going, keep going. Wow, we're actually going to finally make our way out of the cave this time around. Don't blow up there, come on. It's already a shape like a staircase. It's a pain enough to get up that. Get out of here. Now, where did you spawn? Perhaps right here. Hmm. Could be anywhere, really. I can't tell how dark things or how bright things have to be when I have the brightness up this high. Is this the right direction? Yes, it is. Okay. Wow, we were way in this cave, weren't we? Of course, now we're sort of. Look at the mini map. We're sort of spiraling around under our house. Oh, yeah, here's the bottom of the second shaft. Very nice. Okay. And up we go. Oh, wow. That must have been uh, quite... That's quite a cave down there, and there's still, I think, more that we haven't explored, if I remember correctly. It's this way, yeah. And another workbench right there. Oh, hello. Excuse me. Trying to climb a ladder. Well, that was quite a productive caving venture, if I do say so myself. Oh my god, look at how much of the ocean is frozen. Oh, wow. It's totally c surrounding that island now, and it's moving in towards the shore, too. That's pretty ridiculous. I can't believe that it's that... It's moving that quickly. If you watch, you can occasionally see pixels change on the map, too. Ugh, oh, what a long ladder. How's the crop looking? Ah, uh, more of them have grown. Oh, the reeds! 
Yes, the reeds have grown. Thank goodness. It's about bloody time. Oh, I can't even pick them up. What am I doing? Eh. I don't think that harvesting them at any particular point is going to make things better or worse for us. So, Just go ahead and plant the rest of these. Very nice. And keep them cut low like that. So some of them grew to three, which is good. All right, looks good. So it looks like that room is going to be successful. Back out here in the house, everything looks safe. Yeah, look at how much it's frozen now. That's ridiculous. Take another screenshot of that. Why not? Wow, okay, so we made it back. Very nice. So let's separate our uh, loot and our food and stuff. The cobble goes up here. Wood in here. I really didn't realize I had so much. <laughs> Let's see, um, bollocks, put the gravel away, put the dirt in here too, why not, why not, alright, let's get some stuff cooking here, a couple pieces of there for that iron, a couple pieces here for the gold, alright, so I have enough diamond to make an enchanting table, and all I really need is obsidian, so now the question becomes, how do we get the obsidian? Because I need lava source blocks for obsidian. I need, so I'm going to need to have four buckets of lava if I'm going to make an enchanting table. Hmm. Alright, well, I need more buckets, first of all, if I'm going to have four buckets total. I could just dump this water. It doesn't matter. Creepy creeping? No. Oh, it's almost night. Let me just uh, put this down. Get back inside here. Back in our half-moon house. Let's go ahead and sleep. Why not? Now, wouldn't it be interesting if, if sleeping made you get hungrier? Like you slept through the night and you wake up hungry? That would be interesting. How much iron have we got in here? Some wool. Rotten flesh. I should make a cabinet for food so I can keep track of it all or anything that's related to food. I guess that's everything. Well, eggs are sort of related to food, aren't they? Uh, I need wood to make a chest. So I guess I, I could really get some efficient storage going in here if I wanted to with these chests. So I can just like stick this one right here, which is ugly, but you know, I'm just keeping all my stuff in one place here. Actually, it might not be it might not be smart for me to have them all right there, because I think that's like within creeping range, if a creeper went off outside my door. So maybe I should move this and the workbench to the other wall over there. That would be nice. How the heck do I get chests? There we go. It didn't look like it was getting it. I was... I can't use the axe. Thank you. <laughs> um, there, I suppose. And then workbench. Why do I have so many crafting tables now? Just stick them up on the walls. Why not? That yeah, looks ridiculous. I love it. I love it. Take another box. Why not? Get serious. Kaboom. Eh, we'll take this one out from underneath there. I don't like it being stuck in the corner like that. Just looks silly. Make it a double chest right here. I don't care. Alright, alright, alright. Actually, now I need one more, because I do want one small one just for food. So it doesn't take that much space to store food. So we'll just do that. And put everything that's related to food in here. Da, 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 there we go. Now I need a chest for loot. That's a cobblestone chest. This chest has just stuff in it. Oh, let's get our let's get our iron bars. Very nice, and our gold as well. Very very nice. Okay, now we have four buckets. That's good. So the goal now becomes to go down and fill the other three with lava source blocks. Yep, that's the goal. All right. Um, hmm. So we marked a spot on the map where I could dig down, or we remembered a spot on the map where I could dig a tunnel, but I don't know if that's going to be the fastest way. It might be fastest to actually walk back down through my cave. Uh, I'm not totally sure, but all right, that's the goal. That's the goal here, is to find our way to some obsidian, or just some lava, rather, and bring back three more buckets of it. So, down we go. I mean, I'm not going to 
harvest my crops or anything yet, and I should be I should be bringing food with me, but I'm not. So uh, we'll see how well this turns out. Hopefully, I can just zip down there, grab some lava, and come right back. So I want to get the enchanting table done in this video if I can. I've never made one before. Or I need a book, don't I? Hmm. Yeah, I need more more reeds than I have. Well, no, actually. I think just the amount of reeds I have now is going to be enough. I think nine would do it, because it's three pa three reeds. Where are you, skeleton? Making me nervous. It's three reeds to a piece of paper, three pages to a book. So I can make just the one book with what I have so far. No book shelves yet, of course. There you are, you little bastard. Oh god, there's all kinds of stuff down here now. Oh! Alright, you want to play that game? Oh, let go. <laughs> tried to fire it and it didn't shoot. Hey there, spider. Hey buddy. <laughs> Somebody requested I bring that one back. I'd forgotten I used to do that whenever I saw a creeper. It, was, it wasn't really like a planned meme, it just sort of started happening. <laughs> Alright, and then down... Sh well, wait, is there lava down at this end of this tunnel? No, that was just at that end, wasn't it? Alright, down shaft number three here. The short one. Remaining cautious. Now, was there lava on the bottom of this ravine, or did I have to go deeper? I think I have to go deeper. Alright, we gotta find our way back downstairs. Just checking above me, just checking above me before we go down. Danger from above is always more danger than danger from below. Again, being cautious, being cautious. That's the way I want to go, is down there. But I should have lit this up more. It's too dark in here. Now, none of these dead-ended in lava, I don't think. I don't think we're deep enough yet. Yeah, we're only at, well, we're at 28, which is pretty low, so, <laughs> you know. Remaining cautious. Alright, yeah, here's the ravine. There's the treasure chest with just cobble in it, alright. Now, there's lava out here, isn't there? Whew, man, these ravines are pretty epic, gotta say. Alright, I need something to build with. Oh, balls. I didn't bring any building materials. Hello, Mr. Zombie. Let's get up against the wall. Oh, he's down here. Hey, buddy. I love how much they weaken themselves by falling. Alright, not this way. Let's go down here. Remaining ever cautious. Keep moving. There's some lava. There's some lava. Alright, let's try and take this source block. I don't think we've actually gone down this tunnel yet. I haven't put any torches in here. I'm too low on food. I should not have come here without any food. This is a bad idea. I'm watching for skeletons, because a single stray arrow could throw me into that lava. And that would not be a satisfactory ending for this LP. It's like water and darkness that way. No more lava to take. Oh, God, where is this coming from? Uh, is there a pool up there spilling out? That's the impression I'm getting here. All right, um, I need more materials. Whoop, oh, for a second there, I thought that it didn't drop anything, because I couldn't see the, the piece that it had dropped behind the ones I hadn't mined yet. Now, you can, as you might not know, but you probably do, you can't just take a bucket of lava and fill it up from anywhere. You have to fill it up from a source block, so I can't just wiggle at this and, and get lava. I'm clicking on it right now, and nothing's happening. So what I have to do is find my way up to the top of this. There we go. Being very, very careful. I do not have a bucket of water. This is a horrible idea. Oh, come on, man. Eh, eh. Alright, there we go. Making progress. Alright. That should reduce this flow here. That's good. Still have stuff above my head. Alright, I need to, um... Get more stone. I need to get more stone. I need more building material. Hello? Oh my god, I didn't even see those until just now. I wasn't, I was not messing around, I really didn't. Ooh, there's a tunnel up there. Awesome, more diamonds. 
It's very good. And you see, now I have enough to make a pickaxe and uh, make the enchanting table. I really want to get up there now. Huh. Hmm. <laughs> Remaining cautious. I'll not be lured in by the scent of diamonds only to die. Luffy's Lazuli. Okay, very small cave here. Alright, nice. Four more diamonds just chilling out down here. Very nice. I, uh, I'm glad I spotted those. Let's mine around to make sure that's all of them. They were right uh, here, yeah. Let's look and see. Well, that's great. Very good to find those. Now I have enough for the pick and the enchanting table. Very, very good. Getting a bit hungry. This is not going to end well. I already can tell. <laughs> Don't like how this is, this particular part of the adventure is going. Oh god! No, 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 no. Don't do that. Wow, I should have just mined around this rather than trying to go up through the lava part of it. Oh, this is going to be a bad idea. Oh, this skeleton over there. God damn it. <laughs> Nothing's easy when you're playing on hardcore. Man. Oh, well, that was easy. Thanks for that, Skelly. Carefully clear some space up here. All right. Now, can I reach source blocks? Do not want to fall in. All right. Um. Oh, there's my pick. I didn't bring any more. All right, I'm out of picks except for this iron one. Oh, there's some. There's some lava coming down. Where's the source block for this? It's got to be up above. Oh my goodness. Oh man, oh man, oh man. Alright, um... Just gonna do this. There we go. That helps. That helps. Get out of here. Alright, good. Good, good, good. Oop, out of stone. That's not good. Okay, sorry I'm not really talking in this video. Gosh, I'm just I'm kind of focusing on not dying, which can make things sort of, uh, kind of put things into, into perspective for you. Oh, spiders. Alright. Now, where the hell is this lava coming down from? Is it just pouring off of an edge? This isn't even a... Like, I'm gonna find... I'm gonna get to the top of this and find, like, one source block, aren't I? Oh, man. The way lava spreads in this game is just ridiculous. Alright. Oh, man. Need to head back down here. Get more stone. I'm gonna go crazy, man. I'm gonna run out of this pick before I find the source block for this lava. I should I should I should abandon this adventure. I should try and find the source block somewhere else. You see this isn't there's not even a source block down here anymore, and this lava's just hanging out. Yes, let's let's take another route, shall we? I believe. Yes, down here, we had more lava, more possibilities for lava. There was certainly a lot of obsidian. Yes, here we go. Now, the question is, if, is there still lava under this? Oh, the answer appears to be no. That's disappointing. Shoot. Just one layer deep, eh? You don't usually find those. No more lava around here? How about under the walls? Oh, that's very disappointing. I was really hoping there'd be lava there. Man, alright. Oh, crap. Oh, they're, I'm making it tough for myself, having already put the bucket on these. Jeez. What was I thinking? Alright. Yeah, no lava under there. Man. Disappointment. And then a dead end. Well, that's, uh... That sucks, <laughs> I'll be honest. I don't have uh, what it takes to make a workbench, do I? I don't have a workbench. Or I just make a diamond pick and pick some of this stuff up. I have made it hard on myself, haven't I? 
Oh, uh, well, looks like we're going to get a little bit stalled for now. Uh, I'm going to have to end this video here. And we've, we've done fairly well. We found some more diamonds. But I've probably made a mistake in destroying all the lava already. And turning it to obsidian. So I think in the next episode, we're going to continue exploring down here in this cave. And hopefully find the lava and get out of here before I starve to death. So I'm going to put it in pause. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time on Let's Play Minecraft Hardcore.